From collector cars to car collections, motorsports, and automotive related businesses, Turnkey Insurance. Let's drive together.
girls here, right here at the Beaver Bar today. How you doing? I'm doing and good. And we have Miss Who? I'm Miss Pepper Shark. Miss Pepper Shark, how you doing? I'm doing good. I'm here with my pinups and pump sisters and my ride or die best friend right over here. Hi everyone, my name is Melina Michelle. We come all the way from the city beautiful Orlando, Florida. And here's gonna be a show today about four o'clock. Yes, there is. Is that correct? Yeah. Miss Rats at the Beaver pageant. Alrighty. Well, we'll catch you there. Absolutely. Absolutely. See you on the stage. And don't forget to cheer for us. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. I know. I know I need to try to make a So, hey, I'm Justin Smith. We uh, we are here at Rats of the Beaver, the 13th annual Rats of the Beaver. We uh, this has became a, a big part of uh, the the Run to the Sun weekend that is uh, here in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. We are in um, actually just further south of uh, of Myrtle Beach in a little town called Myrtle's Inlet. It's a great little town. It's a little island town here, uh, down with great food, great bars, uh, known for the Myrtle Beach Bike Week. Um, we're very fortunate to have Leslie Beaver here. She uh, she takes care of us all weekend. She opens her arms up for this bar and uh, pretty much gives me the keys. Uh, this all started 13 years ago over a few beers at a, a local restaurant and uh, started trying to, to do something similar to what they do down in Daytona for rat rods and it has transpired into 250 plus rat rods, hot rods, sleds, motorcycles. Uh, we have a little bit of everything here. You'll see some of the nicest cars you'll ever see. Um, some of the coolest customs, some of the nicest handiwork, some of the best paint jobs, uh, and definitely some of the coolest trophies you'll ever see. And uh, we appreciate Rider TV coming to check us out. And uh, we'll tell you, we can go by and take a look at some of these rides. Check, check. 
Sirs, hey, gentlemen, start your engines. How you doing there? Good, how you doing? That's one heck of a manifold set up there. Yeah, different. I have not seen something quite that quirky, but close. Yeah, Hey, bro, are you the owner of this fine piece of machinery here? The owner would be that gentleman right there. Are you the owner? Yeah. What's your name? Stu. Hello, Stu. Yeah, can you start up for me for just a minute? Let me get the hand crank. <laughs> you trying to say it's an old lady? Old, or old man? So it's basically 350, right? 350? You know, not very often you find the real McCoy. Okay. You ain't kidding. But we found it. <laughs> you know, you gotta love the ingenuity here, man. I gotta tell you, it's 7.30 this morning, I'm out in the back lot, and I hear this thing come in, I'm going, I hear a diesel coming in. I came over, I checked out 43 Chevy, if I remember right. Yes, sir. And we were talking about Where? the motor. And Where's, a like, 40, yeah. Where's a 43 it says Chevy? It 43 Chevy. It is. Uh, <laughs> and we were talking about how many horsepower and stuff like that. You got something like this. I'm willing to guess the motor alone got to be fifty, sixty thousand dollars for something like that. Fully dressed, uh, unfortunately, yes, yes, sir. You're somewhere yep. in that ballpark. Yep. Turbo, fuel, everything. Okay. You're you're flirting with that. So, Chuck, what would what do you think? What would you insure this thing for? Here you go, Chuck. Good, good question. <laughs> you can't compare it with anything. No, of course. There's, no, there's nothing else here like it. Ninety thousand dollars. All right, ninety thousand. Is good, that a good number? A good ninety. I mean, right. let's, look, look what you got here. This is unbelievable. You don't see anything out here. Look at the, look at the work in the bed. I mean, it's unreal. There's, you know? there's more hours that go into something like this than yeah. you would ever think you could get back out of. Sure. Well, that that yeah. was my question. How many hours do you have in it? You, almost three years. Later. Is this is this for sale today? No, sir. All right, I just gotta, figured I'd ask. I don't, think it, I don't think it's going to leave anytime soon. Okay. So where did this idea come from? I got to ask you that question. So we used to do a lot of drag racing and diesel drag racing and stuff of that nature. And, and now that I'm married with kids and a family and everything, we can't go all over the country like we, we used to. So long story short, my dad and me kind of got together. We build engines. And so we, what can we do to showcase an engine? And, and have something cool at the same sure. time. So we came up with this and, and that's where 
we took one of our drag engines and, and basically put it in this thing, which is way overkill for something of this sure. nature, and it couldn't have turned out better. Is this a business for you and your dad? Me, yes, sir. So my dad is a, a retired contractor. Okay. So he, uh, it's more of a hobby for him, and it was a hobby for me, and it turned into a career. Neat. So if somebody else wanted to do something like this, how do they get a hold of you? MB Diesel Performance. MB Diesel Performance. Write that down, okay? And, and uh, whereabouts in North we're, Carolina? Uh, we're about 35 minutes outside of Charlotte, North Carolina. Okay, what town? A town called Mount Pleasant. Yes, oh, Mount Pleasant, well. sure. Yes, yeah. yes yep. absolutely. I, to be honest, I go through Charlotte, Mount Pleasant, okay. spend a lot of time in Mooresville. We're going to have to get together because I want to come up and do a shop tour yeah. on your shop and racing job, too. You absolutely, too. absolutely. We, uh, we, we, we got a bunch of cool stuff for you to yeah. come look at. Well, again, thank you for your time. Absolutely. This is definitely my favorite. Favorite quote unquote rat ride, if you want to say it with a diesel. Whatever here. you want to classify That's right. as. That's All right. right. Here we go. We'll leave here with you.
pedal car. And, uh, I had a buddy give it to us last year, and I just took all the pedal back out of it and uh, built a little chassis for it and just painted it. That is really cool. It used to, it was and a, it's functioning right, it's pedaling still? That's right. And yeah, you can yeah, push it. Yeah, pedaling it. <laughs> it's Very cool, a, man. 64 dude. Can you wave a little bit? Say hey. Say cheese. Oh, he's, hey, what is his name? Sutton. Sutton. How old is Sutton? Almost two. We'll Almost two. two. But this is a family event, so you definitely right. can bring your kids here. 100%. To the reality of the Beaver Bar, no problem. It's a right, it's a real good day. <laughs> Justin, thank you. Couldn't ask for any better. Thank you, buddy. Justin. That's right. Thank you. How long has the show been going on? This is the 13th one. 13th. Yep. Yeah. See you later. See you. Bye -bye. See ya. So we go on cruising. So this right here is like the back entrance. The back of the bar. See what's going on back here. truck is this what are they this is a ctn 61 ctn um actually i bought it the truck had been wrecked so i cut the whole snout off that's a s10 96 s10 front clip on it that's why the motor sits offside and i didn't know it till after i bought it but s10s they offset the motor for the weight of the driver so uh i didn't know that so yeah, yeah. yep so learned a lot <laughs> on this one because yeah. i wanted something to stick through the hood but then i had to i had to style the hood to cover right. up the sideway or the motor that was offset. Yep. Yep. So I guess we're telling me the music starts at five o'clock. We have a pinup contest about four thirty, I believe it is, or four o'clock. Take out some cool cars. Say today they're gonna to have about 250 cars here. Most of them are rat rods. You got a couple of classics and a couple of uh, 
60s year of cars here. I'm sure you're seeing them all. Nice gravel parking lot. Beautiful day here, Merle's Inlet, South Carolina. So how are you doing again? We just we just chatted, but I wanted to get the audio. Hey, so what are you doing here? What are you gonna be doing here today? Man, we got a, we're gonna do a little tailgating here out for a while, man. We got some barbecue here. We're gonna brew up here, build a little fire. We're gonna have a little thing to wrap them up in, nice. man, with some cheese. Now, how long stuff. have you been coming down here to? Man, right that long. How long have you been coming for Beaver? This is my only second year. Second bro. year. Uh -huh. Wow. Huh? And I'll never miss another one as I live. I gotta tell you one thing, everybody down here in South Carolina has an accent. It's good stuff. <laughs> good stuff, good stuff. We actually are about uh, I don't know, 10, 15 miles uh, east of Danville, Virginia. Okay, well. And, uh, great I'd event, like... great day today. Oh man, it's lovely, man. Yeah, yeah. I'll be back to see you. Thank, Thank you, you. Brother. Come on back, man. But you got this grill here. Oh yeah. This is all home built right here. Beautiful. Tiger bug out of Ringo, Virginia. <laughs> you got some you make you make some good barbecue? Yes, you got a good sauce? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> be, it's gonna be the best barbecue in this barn, okay? Right. I'll be back here. I'll be judging you tonight, don't yeah, worry. Yeah, 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 yeah. All that I made myself. Very good, man. Good chatting, we'll talk to you. Yes, sir. Thank you, bro. I'll come back there and check out that barbecue later on yes, today. Sir, by all means, brother. Five o'clock? Yeah, I'll be for the end, man. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah.
The mid engine setup. Yeah. <laughs> setup. yeah. He's done several of these. They're all. What is it, cool. an LS engine or what? Yeah, it's an LS. Yeah, yeah, yeah I thought so. Yeah, he had, he had a. Uh... I think he got a box LS engine. Who owns this truck? What's that? <laughs> Who owns the truck? Where's he at? Uh, that's, that's crazy. Here. This one right here and this. And yeah, this, this, this one right here. Yeah. Name's BJ. BJ. Good job. He's right over there. Love to bend this trailer, too. Jeez. Hey, tell this guy what you, what you got going here, man. Are you, are you the owner of this fine vehicle here? This fine, this is very cool. I built it, but you can be the owner. Okay. How much money you got I with don't you know. today? <laughs> How much are you selling it for? <laughs> 20 What's grand for the car. What's your name? BJ Wolf. BJ, so you are yeah. selling this, huh? Yeah, I sell everything I build. All right. I don't get attached to nothing. All right. <laughs> it's, uh, Give me a number, BJ, if they got to get a hold of you, because I'm going to shoot some video. 540 Here it is, man. No ladies. I got a woman. <laughs> <laughs> this, hey, wait, wait. Whoa, 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 This ain't, 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 ain't your dating profile? Yeah, unless they got money. This ain't your, da this ain't your dating yeah. profile? Yeah, unless you want to buy it. It's a high boost, a 1300 engine, and transmission six speed, of course, and it feeds a three speed GM transmission. So it's got 18 forward gears and six reverses. Six reverse? Yeah. One's never you enough. Burnouts in reverse or what? I hadn't tried the burnouts. I'm going to let whoever buy it do the burnouts. <laughs> okay. Want to fire it up? Go ahead. Yeah, sure. Right. Sure. I hope so. <laughs> Truck will go with it. Not for that price.
my VW fans here. Got the VW rat rod right here. It's like a fun build. Sorry about to hit my camera. <laughs> that happens every so often. Rat Rod VW right here. Nice 38 Ford right here. Love those grills. 38 Ford. How you doing there? Keep going. I ain't going to miss this. We got a whole different name now, the Little Red Wagon. There you go. There you go. It's a Little Red Wagon in wide side. It's cool, huh? Yeah, yeah. Like a family event, right? That's exactly right. What? What you got in it? 
going to 11th grade. Yeah, yeah, I remember that too. But it will, I mean, it turn into a little bit. Yeah, I bet with being down that low. I run it, when I run the car down the highway, I get it just above the front tire. Mm -hmm. And just back tire stroke front tire. The moonshine in the back. Moonshine. This truck here we saw coming in, very cool. There we go. I think I'll have to get it right around it. Thank you.
All right, we got Burt Reynolds and Dolly Parton right here. <laughs> oh, that's a hoop. Pretty cool, man. Yeah, these are. What year is this now? 68. 68. Yes. Oh, we got a visitor. That's cool. I'm going to go. 
W right here. The metal's still coming up to weld the salt. Hey, there, buddy. Yeah, Early engine back here. Chucky's, Chucky's hot rod in here. Look at him go. Grabbing his bride at Chucky. <laughs> Okay, yeah. He's on Barry Jacks, okay. Nice build here.
Hi, how are you doing? Good job. 
my name is Rebel Rocket. I'm from the Grove East, and that is in Denver, North Carolina.
Yeah, one, two, 